Paula Burroughs and I'm your host of American Dream TV and lifelong resident of Lewis County. Today I would love to show you around Centralia and Chehalis, also known as the Twin Cities. Both cities are centrally located between Portland and Seattle, the Pacific Ocean and the mountains. Today I want to show you two outstanding women-owned businesses, Sweet Dough Cookie Co. and Runway Boutique. Here at Sweet Dale Cookie Co. It's early morning and the line's already started. Let's go in. We're at Sweet Dale Cookie Co. today and we are here with Ashley, the owner. Hi. And we just want to introduce you and have you tell us a little bit about your business. Yeah, so uh, basically how I got started, I was 15 years old. My mom took me to a local bakery in Tacoma. We looked through all their lookbooks and I knew that that's what I wanted to do. Um, and I went home and practiced and I grew that skill. And um, I've been baking cakes ever since. <laughs> and about five years ago, um, I started just doing custom orders for cookies. And um, it has grown into this storefront that I get to call my own and it's just been a dream come true. We are only open on Saturdays, 9 a.m. to sell out and there's a line every single Saturday. When I come and unlock those doors in the morning, there's people here with their chairs, um, so it's just been awesome. Top sellers of cookies are Raspberry Cheesecake, Party Animal, and probably my chocolate chip cookies. Didn't you win some kind of baking contest? I did. So um, I was on the Christmas Cookie Challenge on the Food Network, and I won. And then a year later, they called me and they asked me to come back for the Grand Champion episode. So I won that as well. Wow, that's <laughs> yeah. amazing. Yeah, it was awesome. Ashley, thank you for having us in your bakery today. Yes, thank you for coming. Good to see you. Hi, Paula. Good I'm to see you. Welcome at Runway, in. and I wanted to have you show me around today. Oh, we're so excited to have you here. Oh, I'm so. always excited to come Yay. in. <laughs> was Runway born? Kind of over coffee one day. Really? Yeah, kind of. <laughs> yeah, you know, Shantae and I, we uh, worked together years ago, and then, you know, life kind of separated us, and then she called me up one day, and she took me to coffee, and we talked about the possibility of Runway, and yeah. Wow. It was amazing. It was an opportunity that, for both of us to really live out our dreams. I think it was meant to be. I love our community here, and I just feel like it's definitely something that we needed, and people yes, thrive for did. it. Mm -hmm. And I feel like also giving everyone an opportunity in our community to be able to come and touch and feel product, and just to be able to have an experience that they feel valued. What surprised you about opening mm. the runway? You know, being here in Chehalis, the amount of love and support has absolutely surpassed anything I ever expected. What's up and coming for Runway? Well, we've got a lot of fun things that we're planning, a little couple irons in the fire. So I guess, stay tuned. Thank you so much for having me today and I enjoyed the visit to the shop. I'll be in to see you soon, okay? Thank Absolutely. Thank you. Bye, Paula. Bye, Paula. Bye, Paula. Thanks for coming along with us today while we visited Chehalis in Centralia. We're looking forward to our next episode of American Dream TV.